Hi and welcome back to Man V Film. I have been plagued, plagued a lot by my watch pile, my ever-growing watch pile which sits just off to the side here, uh, constantly in my face in front of computer and camera so that it's always there, always present, always alerting me to how large it is growing. Now if you watch the kind of community tab you've probably seen pictures of my ever-growing watch pile and for myself this is something that I find drives the anxiety a little bit uh, for me. I've spoken about this before way back a couple of years ago, uh, it was 2019 I think it started, uh, I decided that everything I bought was getting watched and for the most part I'd say 98% of it I managed to do that. There's obviously the odd couple that slipped through the net when I wasn't paying attention or I just couldn't get to them in time and they're just still to be caught up on. I'm still probably sitting in the watch pile waiting to be watched and I made that decision for a specific reason. I noticed a lot of people were hoarding, gathering for the sake of it rather than collecting films because we are film fans and that's something that really kind of uh, drove into me uh, my passion for films, making sure I was watching whatever I got. If it was a really interesting film or that, I would dive into the extras and check them out. Um, it was always something that I, I kind of took to and I found it to be the most rewarding fact uh, or facet of being a collector, watching what we got. What's the point in getting them, throwing them in to the collection and just marvelling at the cover art, which can be really lovely, but never actually using the disc. You're buying plastic, you're buying paper, but you're not getting the use of it. So when I made a separate section for my watch pile, I would always put new purchases there and try to get through them as quick as I can. Of course, life has its ups and downs. I've had some difficulties recently, um, particularly at work where things have been extremely stressful, I haven't been happy about certain things and I've had to put my attentions elsewhere which meant that a lot of the fun things in life kind of went by the wayside which shouldn't really be the way because usually when things are stressful or tough movies are my go-to to, to de-stress, to get away from everything but things were at a certain level where I just couldn't do that and for a couple of weeks I, I barely watched anything it was it was tough of course there's movies here from as far back as uh, April, March that I picked up in the last indicator sale that I never really watched but they're still there waiting to be watched and I feel that because of me wanting to be a watcher rather than a, a hoarder of just films, this has put a, a kind of pressure onto myself, a, a level of anxiety um, which I really do not like at all. I need to get through the watch pile. I need to get through the watch pile because one, um, it validates me kind of picking up these movies. Two, if I throw it into the collection, the chances of me getting to it um, until like years down the line are probably really slim and I don't want that either and I know some people are, are very different from myself but I'm just talking from my own personal experience. I know people out there buy them, they save them for a rainy day, they're curators, they want to have a large varied collection that they can go to and discover something. For me I need to get it, I need to watch it, I need to put it in the collection, I can go back to it whenever I want and I do on occasions uh, but I need to cull this collection, I need to deal with it. That constant nagging voice in the back of my head saying don't be a hoarder, don't be one of those guys that are just picking up movies, talking about how wonderful the covers are, how many extras are on it and then never watching the disc is something that I vehemently do not want to become. I was an iteration of that before. I will not become that again. So I'm sitting with a, a watch pile of over a hundred movies at the moment and I have um, not a great deal of pre-orders coming up. There's some things I've actively avoided because it's either money or time. Uh, I really wanted to show scope 
volume two set. I can't afford that just now. And to be honest, I don't have the time to sit and watch all those movies. Then there's that little voice in the, in the back of my head saying, well, volume one set keeps getting discounted to a really good price. Should I just wait off and get it at a later date? So my active plan to combat this, to combat the anxiety, is to put in a, an action plan of how I'm going to deal with this. Now, I'm not quite uh, worked out all the details as yet. I have been posting pictures to just post the awareness of what is there. Uh, I think I'm going to make a video, maybe once every fortnight or once every month, talking about the watch pile, what I've watched, what I've added to it, how I'm getting on getting through it, uh, am I close to admitting defeat or will I continue to plough through it? I'm hoping for the latter. I'm hoping that I can conquer uh, this feeling uh, rather of dread and turn it into something exciting because I know that I have got lots of movies there that I really want to check out. Some exciting new favourite movies that I'm going to watch for the first time are just sitting in this daunting pile of films and I won't let it cause me as much stress or anxiety because I am going to work and get through it as much as I can. But it's just one of those little foibles of the collecting community, you know, like uh, the awareness of the different types of collectors that are out there, the different kinds of film fans and what we don't want to be and what we want to be. Uh, kind of suppose we do the same in life, the kind of person that we want to be. I will do this. I want to know uh, what would you like? Do you think a, a video every fortnight or, or once a month just talking about the watch pile, going through the movies, um, talking about how many I took out, how many um, I added, let me know your thoughts on that because I'm trying to uh, change things up. There's not been as many blurry updates because whenever I get movies, I'm trying to watch a bunch of them before doing the updates. That way I have something to talk about other than the lovely covers. Anyway, as I shed myself of this stress and anxiety, I'm looking for your opinions on um, how you deal with your watch pile. Do you have a pile of movies? Do you just stop at a certain number um, until you've conquered it. Do you just add to the collection, which I know some of you do, and you know it's all individual choice, all what works for you. This is my process, and this is how I feel about it. So let me know in the comment box below, and I'll see you next time on Man V Films.